Hey guys, it's Carly. Um, I'm sure by the title of this video you can tell what it's going to be about. Um, I just want to say something real quick. I'm so sorry I haven't been putting up videos lately. Um, you know, sometimes just life gets the best of us and we get really busy and I know that's no excuse, but um, I do want to apologize and say that I'm back on track now and I will be putting up videos a whole lot more frequently. So. Okay, I'm sure most of you have seen Birchbox videos, but in case you haven't, um, let me tell you what Birchbox is about. It is a $10 monthly subscription, kind of like a magazine subscription, um, in which you pay $10 a month and you get deluxe beauty samples. Um, you get about four or five in a box, and it's kind of tailored. Um, you answer a little bit of a survey when you first sign up, and it's kind of tailored to um, what your personal preference is. A lot of the brands I have heard before and some I haven't, um, which is nice because you get to try high-end quality products um, for $10 a month. And um, so let's get started. The box looks like this and I got mine um, a couple weeks ago, but like I said, I've been really busy lately and I haven't had a chance to film it, but I've already um, gone through the box. I meant to put up my um, Birchbox video for last month, but like I said, um, I just didn't get around to it. Um, last month wasn't all that impressive, so you're not missing a whole lot. And I'm sure that there's a ton of other videos out there um, that have everyone else's Birchbox, so you kind of get a, an idea of what uh, came in. Um, each box comes wrapped in this kind of um, plummy, cranberry, purpley type paper. And... As you open it up, um, you get a card like this. Now, I won't read the card because I'm sure that if you look for October Birch Box, everyone's read the card or you know some idea um, of what um, the box is going to be about. This card just lets you know um, what the month is about, um, why Birch Box chose the type of products that they put in the box, and on the back of the card, um, there is a list of items that you have received in your box and a little description and um, how much the full retail size costs. Now, I'm sure I'm like many other people that as soon as I get the box, I look at the card, I quickly kind of scan um, through the reason why um, they put these items in the box and then I immediately flip it over and do a whole glance down as to what's going to be in the box because I don't know. It's exciting. It's exciting when you get a birch box. Like you just never know what's, what products you're going to have in there. Um, so I guess let's get started. But like I said, I was kind of, um, I was really looking forward to this box because last month it was nice, but it wasn't all that um, impressive to me. So I was really looking forward to getting this box. Very excited. Okay, so let's start. The first thing that um, I got in the box was this Be Fine Lip Exfoliator. And I know that some people got the um, other part of the duo. They come in a duo, they come in with a lip exfoliator and then I guess like a lip moisturizer. And so together the duo is retailed for $25. And they gave me one half of the duo and it happens to be the lip exfoliator. And the description for this is a lip healing wonder. Be Fine's gentle lip exfoliator sloughs away flakes and cracks to leave lips very velvety. And I was really excited about this because I don't own any lip exfoliators. Um, it's definitely something that I've been wanting to try. I just, I don't know. I just never ever remember to purchase anything like this. So I was very excited to get this. Um, there's not really a whole lot of directions in the back as exactly how to use it. Um, I attempted to use it once. It did work pretty well. I mean, I did feel like my lips were very velvety smooth afterwards, and I definitely applied moisturizer after using it. So um, I don't know if I would ever purchase this on its own, but I feel that um, this is 0 .3, 34 fluid ounces. So that's quite a bit of product in my opinion, especially something that's going to go on your lips, which is not a very um, big area to begin with. Um, so this will definitely last me a while and I'm really excited I get to try this. So that was definitely very cool. The next item that was in the birch box is the, and I am so sorry, I can't even pronounce this, Caudalio, the Vino Perfect Cell Renewal Night Cream. We'll just go with that. 
and it came in this tiny, tiny little tube. And this is, how much is in here? 0.13 fluid ounces. So that's very, very tiny. That's like, like the size of my pinky, pretty much. And it says, a rich moisturizer that uses a patent grape compound to exfoliate and brighten skin so that you wake up looking perky. Now, um, it says for 30 milliliters, and I think they're going in milliliters because made in France, so the system's different over there. So this is four milliliters. So this is um, just a very tiny sample. Um, for 30 milliliters, it's $68. So that's pretty pricey. I, I mean, I guess if I wanted to, I could calculate how much um, you actually got dollar-wise in here. Um, I won't go ahead and do that, but I haven't tried it yet. Um, I'm only guessing there's probably maybe one or two applications in this, depending on um, how much you use. I um, haven't tried it yet, so I can't say if I like it or not. Um, I definitely would not pay $68 for um, night cream for my face, because I think that's just a little bit ridiculous, so. Okay, the next thing um, that is in the box, which I was really, really excited about, is um, the Laura Geller, that's what it looks like, Laura Geller Spackle Tinted Under Makeup Primer in Bronze. And this right here is a half an ounce, and for the full size, which is two ounces, is $25. So I thought you got a lot of it a product um so again i was really excited to try um something from laura geller i don't own anything from her um so i was really kind of curious to see what her um brand is like i was a little bit skeptical because i don't know if you can tell but in bronze i mean that's very bronze that's pretty dark um and i am not that dark especially since the um cooler weather is vastly approaching um and definitely not that dark so when you take it uh when you take some out of the tube it kind of almost has like um a liquid consistency it's not that dark on my finger but as you rub it into the skin and i don't know how well you'll be able to see you can see a slight tint but then it just it becomes just a gentle wash of color so i've been using this product maybe about a week and a half since i got my box and i must say i'm pretty impressed with it i think you get a lot of product um in this little sample um and it definitely does have a tint to it it's not an over an overly powering tint where it looks like, you know, you're wearing straight bronzer on your face. And it does have like a little flex of shimmer in it. So it does really brighten your skin. And this is something that I definitely would repurchase as far as a face primer. I, um, it's very unique in the way that the consistency is, but I was very, very excited to receive a Laura Geller product in my birch box. And, um, this is probably my favorite product and the one I was most excited about um, getting in my box. So I definitely, definitely, definitely loved it this month. Um, okay, next on the card is the Aura Fluido. Aura, Aura Fluido. I'm not sure I'm saying that right. Probably not. Um, Beauty Elixir. And it comes in a little, um, little vial like this. It's, um, glass. And the packaging is really pretty on it. You can tell that it's a nice, um, thick oil in there. And the description for this is, we don't know what we love more. This hair treatments trio of nourishing essential oils, argon, linseed, and cypress, where it's intoxicating vanilla amber set. Now, I'm sure um, those of you who have seen other videos of mine, you have heard me talk about how damaged my hair is and how I'm really trying to just treat it a whole lot more healthy. And so this was really exciting to me that I had um, like an oil treatment in the birch box. And it smells pretty decent. I'm sure this, this is only going to last one application. Um, but I'm very excited. I haven't tried it yet. I just... I don't know. I, 
I, I'm not so eager to try things when I know that I only have like one application or one sample um, to them. Um, I just, I don't know. So we'll have to, I'll, I mean, I'll try it out. I will definitely use it. And um, let's see, the, how many, you get, this is 0.17 fluid ounces. And the full size is 3.4 fluid ounces. And the full size is $29.99. So that's relatively, I mean, it's expensive, but it's um, definitely not the most expensive thing in this box. So, I mean, you know, if it's good, maybe I will repurchase it. And then last but not least, um, each Birch box, they give you um, an extra bonus gift. Um, and I know that a couple people had mints in their Birch box for this month, and I did not get the mints. I ended up getting this Orib, Orib? I cannot pronounce anything in this box. I, it's horrible. I, it's, if you were to see it, you would, un you would understand. Um, it's the shampoo and conditioner for beautiful color. It says this ultra luxe duo doesn't just stop hair color from fading. It also replenishes dehydrated strands and adds a glossy sheen. So once again, another hair product, super excited. And, um, they actually came in little like sample packets like this and they, I don't know if everyone got two or they added an extra one, but I ended up getting two of these, um, two shampoos and two conditioners. So, um, once again, I haven't tried these yet. Obviously I still have the packages. Um, I don't know if I'm going to try them at home because I think that they're really great, um, traveling travel size um that's another nice thing is that a lot of these products um such as the face primer i mean they're little so they're great for traveling um i think these would be great i probably end up saving these um so next time i go on a weekend or um anything of the sort instead of just bringing like a travel size bottle shampoo and conditioner or you know um if you go on a trip like a plane trip you all you have to do is just stash them in your suitcase and you're good to go so that was my birch box for october um, I thought I got some great products. I was really happy with it. Um, every single time I tear through the box, I just can't wait till the next month um, to see what they end up sending me. So let me know if you guys subscribe to Birchbox. I'd love to see what you got in yours. And I hope you did enjoy this video, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.